What is up DIY enthusiasts? So, what I've got for you today is a video that's going through the, um, what video am I doing today? Uh, the electric. So for the electric, I need a new electric, a 200 amp service on my house. And I don't have a 200 amp service on my house. So it requires electricians and the power company to do their part. My part is going to be digging a trench so I can get a good sub panel out to the garage. So, cue, boom! So I'm running the big saw, the walk behind, so the handheld one, because there's a halfway decent chance I'm going to accidentally cut my face off doing this. Wish me luck. Thanks, rentals. That's why I didn't want to rent one of the handheld ones and why I was pretty cautious about this. I know I say I might not know what I'm doing, but I do a lot of research before I do any of this stuff, so that could have been dangerous. We can shave later and we're back at it. So, so last time we got all these cuts made. And the ones over there. So now we need to get the sledge out and hammer all that out and dig the trench so when the electrician comes, we're good. day three of working on this. Um, got all the cement broke out yesterday and now I'm about ready to start the time lapse and just do a bunch of digging and dig all this stuff out here. So uh, unfortunately this is taking way longer than I thought it would.
Oh, hey, there you are. Well, basically, that was uh, for this. I needed to put a sub panel in here when I got the uh, new 200 amp service to the house. Previous projects, I turned on the table saw and my lights dim. Not the best situation if you're trying to renovate an entire house. So, you even left me a beer. Oh, sweetie, let's see what we got here. Flying dog raging. That, I like that, that's nice. Let's see what we got here. Alrighty, appreciate that. There we go. Yeah. That tastes good. Thank you. Uh, so yeah, I was just saying, dead wire these two uh, circuits here to uh, three spots over on the other side of the garage behind you there. And uh, basically, there's three different spots you can plug in over there. I did that before the electrician ever got here and added this for me. One side is one circuit, the other side is the other circuit, so I can plug my shop vac or dust collector and my table saw into the same spot, and you'll uh, you won't have too much drawn on one circuit. But the bulk of my work was all just getting the path for them to put this in here. Now running an actual sub panel and all that. Some DIYers can do that themselves. That was a little above my skill level, but digging a trench and cutting through and doing all the cement. Actually, that was also a little above my skill level, but I figured I could, you know, screw around and, uh, and figure that much out. So that's what I did. If you enjoyed this video, thumbs up right down there. That means you liked it. If you didn't like it, you can do the same thing. It's just the thumb goes in the other direction. So, but, uh, you know, I've got a lot of videos coming up, so if you haven't subscribed, be sure and do that. That's how you get all these, uh, you know, beautiful videos of me.